hello my lovely people in today's video i'll be sharing with you one of my favorite recipe and to tell you guys this recipe i'm about to show you guys i only have it once a year or twice a year so i would like to share with you <laughs> So guys, first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to chop my onions. And you can cut your onions to any shape of your choice but this is how i want to cut the onions so now i'm going to use coconut oil you can use any oil of your choice but trust me guys if you are not allergic to coconut oil i will advise you to use coconut oil it smells so good tastes so delicious this recipe with coconut oil but if you are someone you don't eat coconut oil you can use any oil of your choice but if you eat coconut oil you must try this coconut oil <laughs> you know what i mean guys <laughs> okay <clears throat> excuse me so i'm just allowing my coconut oil to get melt you know what i mean let it get melt yes this is a simple breakfast you can make for your wife in bed or for your girlfriend maybe when you're on your honeymoon you know you don't want your wife to stress herself for breakfast make this kind of breakfast so i'm going to add my chopped onions inside the coconut oil and i'm going to stir fry my onions till it's kind of like golden brown you know you guys <clears throat> you need to s the smell oh my days i know the smell will be alerting my neighbors right now coconut oil is just so good and make sure it's the organic coconut oil you are using organic coconut oil trust me you can never go wrong with this recipe so simple and delicious but i try not to abuse it that's why i normally have it once a year or twice a year so this year this is my first time of having it i don't know whether i'll have it again before end of this year <laughs> i might i might not but sometimes i want to treat myself good that's what i normally do so i have my bread uh this is kind of french bread i bought this in lidio if you live in uk you know lidio you know but to tell you guys you can use any bread of your choice really you can use sliced bread or any other seed um oatmeal bread but <clears throat> this bread is the best or any other fr this is like a french bread you know and they just bake it this morning so i was lucky it was really hot when i got it so as you guys can see nice and soft that's why um because this bread is not you know i only eat it once a year so <laughs> it's not bad <laughs> so you can see i cut it into half half and i'm back to my onions and as you guys can see my onions is getting golden brown so i'm going to empty it inside a plate And I have my two eggs. So I'm just breaking the egg inside the onions. Yes. I'm just, <clears throat> excuse me. I'm just whisking it. Whisking, 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 whisking it. So 
so now guys i'm going to add aromat but if you don't have aromat you can use salt to taste or if you have any other seasoning powder that you use for your cooking you can just use it just to give it you know that bit sweetness flavor you know so i'm just mixing it after mixing i'm going to add milk and i use semi skin milk so any milk you use you can just add it so it doesn't have to be this particular milk i'm using so i'm just mixing all together all together all together you know <sighs> so now this is interesting part i'm just putting the bread i'm dipping it inside the egg can you see just make sure you press it let the bread soak the egg and let the egg soak the bread you know what i mean guys yeah and flip it over and then you know just do it that way trust me <laughs> mothers this is <laughs> if you don't school around during the during the week and you want maybe weekend like today saturday now i want to have this you know make breakfast like this and sit down your sofa use the cover to cover yourself you know on the tv and enjoy yourself you know what i mean guys <laughs> now i have another cocoa i have coconut oil again <laughs> i'm gonna pour in the frying pan you know and i'm also going to allow it to get melt i mean why my bread is still inside the egg soaking soak inside the egg guys so now i'm going to take it and put it in the frying pan oh my days guys you guys need to try this you my fellow women you need to try this or any of any my any of my, any brother in the house that you want to make breakfast for your wife and you know that ah you don't want to stress yourself you know and one thing i didn't mention earlier you can also use tomato yeah you can use any any orishi rishi you use for your egg if you feel like you want to add to it just fry it maybe tomato or pepper just fry it with the onions before whisking it with the egg the way i did it but i just this is how i enjoy mine i don't really like tomato in my egg really i like it like just with the onions that's why i'm making it you can also use sardine or geisha you know anything used for your egg even miss vegetables yes guys just do it, you know, and make it, make it for your husband or make it for your wife or your girlfriend or your fiance. You know what I mean? Just simple breakfast. It's really yummy and delicious. Oh, come and smell it. Come and taste it. <laughs> I remember when I make it, <laughs> I plan to have the four. My daughter did not let me finish it. She asked some, say, mommy, oh my days, I can pay 15 pounds for just one of the slides. I'm saying, God forbid, bad thing. <laughs> why don't you just copy the recipe and make it yourself she said mommy i know but this is how good it is this is how good it is i've never had anything this good i'm like those day when i'm having it you guys always say you don't want it and you guys i told you guys i only have it once a year once a year it, yummy food like this. you don't want to abuse it all the time trust me guys <laughs> so i'm gonna leave it to cook i blow the cooker And now I have my, uh, my plate. I'm just pouring milk. I pour milk, 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 milk. And I'm going to warm my milk because I don't like cold milk with my cereal. I like warm milk with my cereal. So now my bread is ready. I'm going to take it out from the cooker. Can you guys see? Ooh, magic. <laughs> And now I've poured my conflict inside my milk and this is my yummy French bread. I'll call it, I think we should call it French toast. Guys, I'm sharing this recipe because I know you guys might like, this is not the kind of recipe you're looking for. But trust me guys, taste this before you judge. Thank you for watching. See you guys in my next video. Bye.